What's up guys, it's Sydney and this is your 40 minute strength and cardio total body circuit. So grab a medium set of dumbbells and let's get to work. What's up guys, I hope you're ready for this 40 minute circuit workout. We've got strength exercises and we've got cardio exercises. Okay, so before we start, I've got medium dumbbells here, not my heaviest, but not my lightest. Um, I've got fives and eights, so pick a couple options or kind of a middle ground for you, uh, whatever fitness level you're at. Also got a sweat towel and some water, so this is gonna be a good workout, okay? So let's start with a quick warm up and then we'll jump right into it, okay? Butt kicks in three, two, one, let's go. All right, so while we're warming up, I'll give you the style of the workout today. This week is gonna be all timed interval themes, okay? So we're gonna have a different timing style within every workout, okay? Some of them are gonna be high intensity intervals. This one's gonna be kind of a drop set interval. All right, let's go side, big wide step, left and right. All right, we're also gonna have AMRAPs, as many rounds as possible timing. We're gonna have E-bombs, every minute on the minute. We're gonna have minute breakdowns where you'll do 20 seconds of one thing, 20 of another, 20 of another. So all that to say, this week is gonna be timed interval themed week. Every day your timing will be different, the breakdown of the workout will be different, just to give you an option for a bunch of styles. All right, let's step it back. Hamstring high kicks. So today's breakdown is gonna be 60, 40, 20. Okay, so we've got 60 seconds of one exercise. Your next exercise will go for 40 seconds, which will be a little bit more intense. The last exercise is 20 seconds, the highest intensity. Okay, so as the time goes down, the intensity goes up. Let's cross those arms over. So I want you to remember that as you go through your 60 second round, Take your time, pace it out. Get through the 40 second round, step it up a little bit. Your 20 second round is all out. All right, so 15 seconds, we're gonna start with a squat move. Okay, so go ahead and grab your heavier set of dumbbells of the two if you have them. Your first move is gonna be 60 seconds of a dumbbell squat with two pulses at the bottom. Okay, it looks like this. One, two, stand, all right? Go ahead and join me, let's go. One, two, and up. One, two, up. One, two, up. One, two, up. Great job, so we've got one minute here. Really practice on your squat form. If you're modifying, don't take it down as low, so go halfway. Still give me that pulse and make sure to keep your abs nice and tight. Okay, so down, pulse, down, stand. Stand. 20 seconds left. Keep your chest up. Abs are tight. Pulse and stand. Good job. Five seconds. Three, two. Go ahead and drop your dumbbells down front. We're gonna go lateral squats. Down, up, down. Okay, 40 seconds right here. So a little bit more intense. You're moving a little bit more. Two planes of motion here. Then you've got your frontal plane of motion. And then you've got your sagittal plane of motion with the up and down movement. Okay, so two different directions. Not too crazy, but just a little bit more intense than your regular front squats. 15 seconds. 10 seconds, I'm sorry. And you're gonna drop the dumbbells and give me squat jumps, okay? Four, three. Drop your dumbbells, two, one, let's go. Sit and stand. Seven seconds, and you've got one more round of that. Three, two, one, rest. Okay, back to the top, one minute, squat with the pulse. Okay, so last time you'll do this one. We've got two rounds through each. 
Set of three. After this, we're gonna move on to a little bit of arm work. Now breathe. That's it, I know the quads are burning. I wanna challenge you to really keep your abs tight at the bottom. Okay, so if you get down here, core tight, core tight, core tight, press. There we go, 20 seconds. And keep breathing. Good, these front squats are great to be able to sit your butt way back, right? Good, give me one more. Four, three, two. Drop your dumbbells down in front. Lateral squats. Down and up. That's it, 40 seconds here. And then you know what's next. 20 seconds of squat jumps. And then we got a quick rest. And we'll move on to our arms. Hope you guys are having an awesome day today. Or if you're just getting started with your day, I hope you have a great day. 10 seconds, last round of squat jumps. Five, four, three, two, drop your dumbbells, hands out front. Let's sit and push. This is it right here. Whew. Yes, I know it burns. Take your time getting down there and then sink it down and then jump it up. Five seconds, four, three, two, one. Breathe and shake your legs out. You got a 30 second rest right here. Woo. Okay. Yes, that burned, but we're done with our legs for a little bit. All right. Next movement, we're gonna go together in about 10 seconds, is a curl, press, and tricep extension. Looks like this, curl, press, triceps, okay? Go ahead and come with me, two, one, let's go. Bicep curl, shoulder press, tricep extension. We've got this one for 60 seconds. If you need to drop your weight down, that's okay. Maybe you keep it low here, and then second round, or in your 40 second round, you step it up. Great job. 30 more seconds here. All right, so if that was too easy, go ahead and step up your weight now. Also, if you're looking for heavier weights, I link all of my dumbbells in the description of this video. I link the brand that I use, so you can go in there and pick which weight you need next, because we're always looking to challenge ourselves. So if you're in need of that next level challenge, scroll down in the description. I link my dumbbells right there. Three, two, one. Next move, take the, cur or take the tricep out. Curl, press, down, down. Okay, so speed it up just a little. We've got 40 seconds here. Good, good. Bicep curl, press, and back down. Great job. 20 seconds. That's it, that's it. Good, guys. Last 10. After this one. Don't go yet, I'll show you what we're gonna do. Four, three, two. Dumbbells at your shoulders, you've got press jacks. Feet together, up, out, up, out. Let's go. Modification, step, step, step. Just tap those feet side to side. Okay, whatever your level, go there. You got four, three, two, one. Great job. You're back to curl, press, tricep extension. All right, one minute, last round through each of these three exercises. And then we're gonna move on to a little cardio. Okay, so I told you it's strength and cardio. Next circuit is all cardio. Good job. Press, bend at 90 degrees, straighten back up, and then come all the way down. Great job, 35 seconds. You're gonna take that tricep out of it and just go curl and press. Okay, I'll tell you when. Not yet, I'll tell you when to switch. Make sure at the bottom, you're not swinging your dumbbells back. 
Keep that technique here. Contracted bicep. 15 seconds. Shoulders bend almost all the way, but not quite. Nine, eight, seven. Good, give me one more rep with the tricep extension. Three, two, one. Next rep, no tricep. Curl, press, and back down. Let's go. Great job, knees are slightly bent. Okay, so you don't end up arching your back here, right? Bend your knees just a little, keep your abs tight. No tricep. <laughs> Good, keep that same speed. Up, down, down. Up, up, down, down. Great job. 15 seconds. And then we're going for our last round of press jacks. Remember, if you're modifying, just step and step, okay? In three, two, one. Press it out, let's go. Great job, another modification is just one dumbbell. Okay, so if you need to modify even further, here. Good job, five, four, three, two, one, and breathe. You've got your second 30 second rest. Great job. You're gonna move your dumbbells out of the way for this next one. This one's all cardio, all body weight. So no dumbbells needed, but grab a quick drink. Try to give you guys a good mix. So, this conditioning round is all body weight. It's all about moving yourself, okay? First move, you're gonna go step and close. Two options, hop, okay? Arms out, legs out, together, together, okay? Go ahead and go with me. If you need a modification, take that jump out. Step, close, step, close, okay? Here we go, if you can, jump way over with me. And close, over, close, over, close. Kind of like a jumping jack. This is a little different. So you've got one minute here. Open, pull, open, pull. Good. Last 30 seconds. Moving fast. If you need to step it up a little bit, move your feet quicker. Boom, 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 boom. Okay, challenge yourself. 15 seconds. You're going into lateral jumping jacks. Okay, I'll show you in 10. Good, five, four, three, two. Move to the side, let's go. Here, 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 and switch. Modification, step, 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 okay? If you're not modifying, Move quickly back and forth. Okay, I don't want these long, drawn out, flailing jumping jacks. Keep it quick. <sighs> 15 seconds, and we're going into lateral high knees. Nine, eight, seven. Good job, you've got 20 seconds of high knees. In three, two, one, let's go. Right here, modify, march, 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 okay? Move, move, move. 10, eight, keep it up, keep it up. Five, four, move quicker. Three, two, one, step it out. Back to the top. That's it, last round through this cardio. And then we're gonna hit a little bit of abs. A little obliques and rectus abdominis or your six pack muscles. Good, remember to breathe. If you're modifying, you're stepping, stepping, stepping. Okay, keep rocking. Great job. Last 30, your shoulders might be feeling it a little bit. That's okay. We just worked them pretty hard. You'll get to rest them in just a second. 20 seconds, and you're moving to those fast lateral jumping jacks. Ten, nine, eight, five, four, three, two. Move it to the side. Jumping jacks. Let's go. One, two, three. Switch. One, two, three. 
two, three, good job. Good, 20 seconds, and you're switching to high knees, and we're done with cardio for a bit. Woo, keep it up. 10, nine, eight, seven, four, three, two, high knees, and let's go. Good, good, good. Keep the abs in tight. Bend forward just a little and work those arms. Come on. 10, nine, eight, five, four, three, two, rest. Amazing job. Come on down to your mat. Your next exercise is gonna be for your abs. Breathe and come on down. Good work. All right, your first exercise is gonna be a sit up with an oblique crunch. First part, you've got one sit up, roll to the side, oblique crunch. Back to the middle, sit up, roll to the side, oblique crunch. We've got one minute there, let's go. Sit up, down, roll, oblique. Sit up to the other hip, oblique. If you need some help getting up, take your dumbbell, squeeze, squeeze, and squeeze. Okay, if you need that modification, go ahead and take it. If not, keep rolling all the way over, obliques, sit up, obliques. So you wanna think knee to elbow on the obliques, right? You're squeezing right here, right in between your hips and your ribs. Roll it over, knee to elbow, and sit up. Great job. Three, two, one, stay down flat. You're gonna go jackknives, left and right. Reach to the opposite toe. If you need a modification, just bend your knee, come up and touch. Okay? Take whatever level you need for 40 seconds. Last 20. It's a little more intense than the first round, right? Good job. Oh, 10 more seconds. You're gonna come up to a seated position. No, I'm sorry, you're gonna lay down. Stay here. Two, one, hands under your tailbone. Flutter. Tiny flutters. Right here, pull the lower belly down. If you need to modify, go higher. 10 seconds, let's go. Good, four, three, two, one, rest. You're back to sit-ups with the oblique crunch. Let's go. Roll it over. Crunch, knee to elbow. Sit up, roll it over, knee to elbow. Good job, roll, crunch. Sit up, and crunch. Modification, crunch, roll, crunch, roll. Okay, just don't come all the way up. That's your modification. Take it if you need it. Like I said, don't be ashamed of making it work for yourself, right? That's a sign of someone who really wants it. They'll do whatever it takes to make it work. Good job. 10 seconds and you're going back to jackknives. That's it, three. Two, one, big deep breath. Jack knives, let's go. Right to left, left to right. Great job. Keep working, 20 seconds. Up, down, up, down, up, down. Come on. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5. We're going back to the flutters in 3, 2, 1. 
Hands under your tailbone. Pull the belly button down. Let's go. Small and quick. If you want to make it easier, go higher on your legs. Make it harder, drop down low. Seven, six, five. Pull the belly button down. Two, one, and rest. Whew, 30 seconds rest here. Great job. Come on up, grab some water. You got a short rest period, and then we're gonna come up and hit your hamstrings and your glutes. Okay, if you have dumbbell options, we're gonna go for the heavier options first. All right, 60 second round. Go ahead and grab your dumbbells. We're going for a Romanian deadlift. Here, curl, punch backwards. Okay, come with me. Romanian deadlift first. Bring it to your chest, punch over your opposite shoulder. Glutes, shoulder. Glutes, shoulder. Romanian deadlift, there's a little bend in your knees. Shoulder blades are back, reach, and then rotate. Complete the whole Romanian deadlift before you come up and try to turn. Squeeze the butt in, then rotate. Rotate. 20 seconds left. Good job. Good work. Eight seconds. Good job. Four, three, two, one. Romanian deadlift. One leg, middle. To the other leg, middle. Okay, one leg at a time, and bring it up right to a front raise. So I want you powering that deadlift with your hips. Slide it down, lift. Slide it down, lift. Focus on the glute squeeze. Squeeze on the way up. Good, squeeze. That's it. 10 seconds. Slide, lift. Five seconds. You're gonna take that Romanian deadlift back to the middle and come all the way overhead. Watch me. Down, overhead. Reach down, overhead. Let's go. Hips forward and then bring your dumbbells up across your chest. From the front, looks like this. Reach, up. Reach, up. There we go. Good work. Rest. All right, we're back to RDL. Crossover here and up and over. Deadlift, up and over. Really want you to feel the stretch in the hamstring. The slight bend in your knee is going to help that. Keep rocking. Down, up, squeeze forward, and then turn. Good job. You're doing great. 20 seconds, and you're switching back to that single leg RDL. Go into one side or the other, and bring your dumbbells up in the front. Come on, 10 seconds, you got it. Reach, squeeze, push. Reach, squeeze, last one. Great job. A little bit wider stance. Let's go down, middle. Hips come forward to get those dumbbells moving, right? Up, down, up. Good, just a little more intense than that first minute, right? 20 seconds. I'm right there with you. I feel it in my arms. I'm burning just like you are. We've got this though. Think about the glutes now, okay? We know the shoulders burn. Think about the glutes. Four. Three, two, one. Bring him back in. Hip width, deadlift to overhead. Last 15, and then you get to rest. Squeeze those legs. Stretch your hamstrings. Pop the hips forward. Push. Dig the heels down. Push. Three, two, one. Rest. Amazing job. Grab a drink of water. You've got your 30 second rest here. <sighs> And then we're moving on to shoulders. Great plan, right? 
Shoulder, shoulders. <laughs> So, if you want to drop down to your lighter set, that's fine. Okay, 10 seconds. We're gonna go front raise, side raise. Okay, looks like this. In three, two, to the side, into the front. Okay, slight bend in your knees, pull your abs in. Let's go. Side, down, front, down. Pull the abs in. We don't want your back taking any of the work. Okay, no flailing either, so don't pop those dumbbells up. It's all controlled by the shoulder. Right up to your shoulder height. You don't need to go any higher than eye level in the front, shoulder level on the side, okay? Last 30 seconds right here. I'm pretty excited about this week of timed intervals. I know I tell you guys I like switching it up for you as far as exercises go. But this week we're actually gonna switch it up in terms of how we break the workout down. 10 seconds. Good, five seconds. Three, two, bring your dumbbells to the front of your leg. You're gonna go up, out, down, and then right back to the front. Okay, so outward circles and inward circles. On the side, do not go past your shoulder, okay? When you look to the side, you should not see your dumbbell passing your shoulder towards your back. Keep it out front. Outward circle, down. Inward circle, down. That's it. 13 seconds. Great job. Woo! I know. Four, three, two, Watch me, we're gonna go front and side at the same time. One to the front, one to the side. Down, switch. Switch. So you're thinking, right side, L. Okay, make a shape of an L with your arms. Left side, L. Right side, L. There you go. Four, three, two, one. Take a little shimmy break, woo! Okay, we're back. Side and front. Last round, let's work those shoulders. We're getting close to summertime, right? If you're watching this when I put it out, it's May, no, yeah, it's May 2018. So in the Carolinas, in the US, it's getting nice and warm, which means lots of time outside, tank tops, bathing suits. All right, we're getting ready for summer here. So I wanna make sure those arms are nice and chiseled. A nice definition to the shoulder, to the back of the arm, right? I love a nice rounded shoulder cap, okay? Just gives such good definition. Gives you appearance of you work hard for how your body looks, right? Whoo, we got 12 seconds. And then we're going to those outward circles, inward circles. Five seconds, four, three, two, one. Drop them down front, let's go outward first. Up, out, down. Up, in, down. There you go. Control them on the way down so you're not slamming down on your legs, right? To the front. Slight bend in the knee so your back does not arch. That's it. 20 seconds. You're almost there. Great job. Keep working with me. 10 seconds. And we're heading down to your abs after this. In five seconds, whew, give me the alternating directions. Two, one, let's go. L to the right, switch. L to the left. Whew. One front, one side, switch arms. One front, one side. 10 seconds, let's go. Nine, eight, seven, six, speed it up. Three, two, one, rest. Great job. Whew. All righty. Grab some water if you can pick it up. <laughs> if you're not jelly arm like me. <sighs> okay, heading on down to the mat for your abs. Whew. All right, first exercise in 10 seconds. You're gonna go one leg raise, two toe touches. Okay, hands under your tailbone. You're gonna lift it up one time. Go up, one, two, back down, ready? Join me, lift it, one, two, back down, back up. 
One minute right here, 60 seconds, first round through. Remember, the goal of this one is to press your belly button down, lower back stays flat on the floor. You do not let your back arch. It helps me to keep my head crunched up. Okay, so that kind of gives my spine a nice uh, motive to flatten at the bottom. Down, up, only go as low as you can control. So if that's right here, and you're back up, that's fine. Keep your back safe. That is the mission here. Keep working out hard, getting better, maintaining no injuries. Okay, pain free. <sighs> Aside from a slight burn every now and then. <laughs> Three, two, one. Leave your legs up, open them out to the side. You're crunching to the left, to the right. <sighs> 40 seconds here. <sighs> Over. Down, over, keep rocking. Reach over outside each leg, all the way down and back up. If you want to step it up, take a dumbbell with you. All right, crunch, down, crunch, down. Try not to hit your leg like I just did. <laughs> Great job, two, one. Drop that dumbbell down. We're going flutters. Whew. Outward. Lateral flutters. Good job. Out, 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 in, in, in. Out, in, out, in. That's it. Four, three, two, one. Okay, we're back. Leg raise. Up top. Crunch, crunch. Back down. Leg raise. Up, crunch. Crunch, that's it. Up, crunch, crunch, down, up. Remember what I said about the lower back. If it starts rounding, don't go as low. Come halfway and come right back up. That's fine. You have to be in control of your abs. The more you work at it, the better it will get, but don't push it to the point where everything hurts. Just to kind of push yourself. Push it to, the point where you stay in control of it. <sighs> squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. Back up. 13 seconds. Breathe out. Keep breathing. Five, four, three, two. Leave your legs up here. Spread them out side to side. Now remember, you don't want your legs way up here. You want them a little past your hips, okay? So you have room to come up to your legs. Up, good, good, come on. Woo. 15 seconds, and you're going lateral flutters. Woo. Eight, seven. Two. One, hands under your tailbone, going out to the side, as low as you can control. Out, in, out, in. Pull the lower belly down to your mat. Tilt your hips backwards. Five, four, three, two, one, rest. Oh, great job, breathe for a second. We've got one more circuit, guys. 30 seconds rest right here. This first exercise, I want you to watch me, okay? For one minute, you're gonna go burpee, inchworm, okay? No jumping involved, so watch closely. Okay, you're gonna start, hands down, pop your toes back. You're gonna alternate between your hands walking and your feet walking, okay? Hands back to your toes, and then feet up to your hands, okay? Go ahead and join me, we've got one minute right here. No jumping, inchworm your hands, inchworm your feet. Out, out, out. Okay, and once you get the hang of it, I want you to speed it up a little bit. Walk, walk, walk. Back, back, back. Hands, hands, hands. Hands, hands, hands. Great job. This also tells you if you're getting here and you're starting to bend your legs, you need to work on your hamstring flexibility, okay? This will tell you, it's a good indicator. 
Good, you've got 15 seconds. And then you're gonna grab a set of dumbbells. Hands, walk it flat. Feet, walk it flat. Okay, five seconds, go ahead and come on up. Grab your dumbbells. Three, two, one. All right, dumbbells down. Burpee and deadlift. Okay, 40 seconds here. Bring your feet out wide at the top. Stand right up, no jumping. Back, wide, stand. If you need to modify, place your dumbbells down. Step it back, step it up, and stand, okay? Whatever level you're at, take it there. Up, back, wide, stand. Great job. Two, one, release your dumbbells. Burpee in and out, and jump. 20 seconds here. In and out, jump, in and out, jump. Good. Six, five, four, three, two, one. Rest, you're back to your burpee inchworms. Walk the feet back, hands back. Walk, walk, walk. Feet up, walk, walk, walk. Okay, inchworm and inchworm the opposite way. One, two, three, one, two, three. Whew. This is it guys, last round of your last circuit. You've got 30 seconds left of this inchworm. Move your hands faster, ready? Let's go. Feet, 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 walk, walk, walk. Hands, hands, hands. Whew. We're coming up for burpee deadlift in 15 seconds. Walk, walk, walk. Flatten it out. Good job. Seven, six, five. Go ahead and come on up. Grab your dumbbells. Three, two, one. Let's go. Oops, wrong ones. Okay, back, wide, stand. When you stand, I don't want you rolling your back up arched, okay? I want you standing with your legs as your source of power. That's it. Here we go, 20 seconds. We're going for that last round of body weight burpees. I don't want an all out sprint on that one. 10 seconds, do not slow up yet. We're close, but we're not there. Here we go, four, Three, dumbbells out of the way, big deep breath. Two, one, let's go. Jump, jump, jump. If you're modifying, step it, step it, stand. Let's go, come on. Four, three, give me one more. Two, one, and rest. Woo. Amazing job. Breathe for a second. You have made it. Amazing job. I know that was a tough one. I know you're probably burning in places like shoulders, quads, breathing heavy, dripping sweat. I'm right there with you, I totally get it. Okay? Give me a big wide stance. When you're done grabbing your water, we're gonna stretch it out and we're gonna cool it down. Stick around for this one. Afterwards, I'm gonna give you a good promo, give you an update on how our channel is growing because I'm so thankful for us as a community getting to work out together. Pull the right arm up over, or left arm over to the right side. I'm so glad wherever you are, you're working out with me right now. This means a lot to me. It means a lot when you check in, you let me know that these workouts I put up for you are working, they're helping, they're adding to your life and they're helping you focus on you, right? There's so much going on in our own world and you know, in our immediate surroundings as well as just the world in general. So it's nice to just take time, dial it in, and just focus on you, right? So I hope today you leave this workout feeling refreshed, feeling proud of yourself, and feeling like someone appreciates you. That's someone is me. I appreciate you being here. Grab onto your right foot. 
Just working out with me and sweating and caring about yourself. Even if it's just for 40 minutes today, keep this in your mind, okay? Whether you're at the beginning of your day, ready to tackle the whole day, or you're closing out your day, ready to go home and unwind to get ready for the next day. Just remember, this was for you. Keep this momentum going, okay? Channel this positive energy into something else in your life, okay? Into your relationships, into your nutrition, all right? You put in work here. You don't wanna go back to the kitchen and just undo it all, right? If you need some help with that, your nutrition, because I, I want you to have the total package here. If you need some help with that, scroll down in the description of this link. I've got a massive nutrition program inside my 30-day transformation program, and I'm gonna be giving 50% off of that. It's on my website, because together, we just reached 7,100 7, subscribers together as of May 4th, 2018. Right, we reached 7,000, oh yeah, 7,100 subscribers together, and we passed over 2.5 million minutes viewed, I'm pretty sure. Five or six, we're right in there, so we're growing together, guys, and I wanna thank you for that. I wanna genuinely let you know how much I appreciate it. This channel is something I've been dreaming of for a long time, and it's growing so wonderfully all because of you. So make sure you take advantage of that massive nutrition program inside my 30 day transformation program. Scroll down in the description, you can take 50% off by using the promo code we did it because we did. And um, also it's got in that program some workout videos that are a little bit different than the ones that I offer on the channel. So you can work out in that way. You can also take the gym program to the gym with you. I've included a gym program, exercise video index to explain every exercise I have in the program. And you'll be involved in a community wall as well with other members in that program that are going through it with you. Okay, so scroll down, take advantage of that. Also, if you're looking for dumbbells to challenge you, like I said in the beginning, I have links to my dumbbells that I use. You go there, you click the weight that you need and they'll be shipped right to you, okay? So make sure you scroll down. Head to the 30 Day Transformation Program on my website. Take advantage, support me if you want to. There are links below. You guys have asked how to support this channel to keep it going. I, of course, don't expect that out of you at all. I'm just glad you're here. But if you feel like in your heart you would love to do that, I have links below for you and that's just an option. Like I said, I don't expect it at all. I'm just so thankful that you're here with me. Thank you for working out with me today and I cannot wait to work out with you tomorrow as we continue on in this timed breakdown interval week. All right, make sure you like this video if you liked it and subscribe before you head out so you and I can do this again tomorrow. Have an awesome day, guys. Bye.